There will come a time, there will come a time when God will no longer tolerate the sins of Mystery Babylon and will destroy her. Before that happens, however, God in his mercy warns his people to sever their relationship with the whore of Babylon. In Revelation chapter 18, verses 4 through 5, God warns, quote, Come out of her, my people, that ye be not partakers of her sins, and that ye receive not of her plagues, for her sins have reached unto heaven, and God hath remembered her iniquities. End quote. Revelation chapter 17, verses 12 through 18, and all of Revelation 18 record the end of the age destruction of mystery Babylon. This, this, absolutely horrible description says that it will be so rapid and complete that it can only be accomplished by modern nuclear weaponry. Revelation chapter 18 verses 10 and 11 describes the financial depression that this destruction will bring upon the whole earth. Quote, Alas, alas, that great city Babylon, that mighty city, for in one hour is thy judgment come, and the merchants of the earth shall weep and mourn over her, for no man buyeth their merchandise any more. The headquarters of Mystery Babylon cannot, dear listeners, be Rome. It should be obvious that if Rome were obliterated by a nuclear bomb today, the world economic system would not suffer. Conversely, if London, the financial capital of the world, were likewise destroyed, the world economic system would suddenly halt, collapse, as indicated in the scripture. English Freemasonry is the mother of harlots. London is Mystery Babylon. Ground Zero is at 10 Duke Street, St. James, London, England, SW1, the 33rd degree Supreme Council Headquarters of English Freemasonry. Now you know the identity of the Queen of Babylon and you know the identity of Mystery Babylon. And now there is no excuse for not coming out of her as you were admonished to do in the book that you all claim cannot lie.